Hmm. Disgusto? O un espresso? Which one should I choose? Hmm. Aha. What if I tell you you can have one coffee machine that can use Nespresso capsule, those Gusto capsule, or even ground coffee powder? Coming right up. Hello everyone, welcome back to Chipo Review. This is George here. So if this is your first time here, kindly hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon so that you receive updates whenever I post a new videos about the cheapest product or the cheapest deal, most budget deal that you can get in the market. So today we are gonna talk about coffee machines. It is very is a very tough time for us now. So because of the COVID-19 pandemics, uh, a lot of us are actually uh, it's under lockdown, uh, we need to stay at home and avoid going outside. So it is very hard for us to even get a nice cup of coffee, right? Because the coffee shop is closed or you can't even go out to get yourself coffee. So what? how can we solve this? By getting a coffee machine. So in the market, there are actually there are a few type of coffee machines. You can either go for the capsule one or you can go for the more expensive you know the ground coffee types of uh, coffee machines so for capsule coffee it is the simplest and the easiest way for you to get a nice cup of coffee you just pop in the capsule and click a button and that's it well for ground coffee machine you need to do extra a few steps for example you need to grind your coffee and you also you need to filter your coffee okay so for capsule coffee uh, especially in Malaysian market we have two main brands so I'm going to show you here. So the first one is Nespresso. Okay, this is Nespresso capsule. And another one is Dos Gusto. Okay, so both of these is actually uh, from Nestle. But actually their capsule size is different. So you actually need two types of machine to operate these capsules. Okay, so for Nespresso, it's actually more suitable for those coffee lovers, those people that is very particular about coffee, you know, for the flavor of coffee. So Nespresso is very good for that because Nespresso has a wide range of coffee beans, you know, from Indonesia coffee beans to Africa of coffee beans. There are a lot of choice for you. While for those gusto, it is not only focusing on coffee. You can also find other type of drinks, for example, green tea. Okay, this is green tea, matcha green tea, or you can also even find Starbucks coffee, you know, Starbucks coffee in here. They also have like chocolate. Okay, so this is more for casual drinker. Yeah, so now let me show you the capsule size. As you can see here, this is Nespresso capsule and this is Toast Gusto capsule. Okay, so they are different in size. Usually you need two type of machine for that. So uh, each of the machines is actually cost around 500 ringgit for those gusto and also Nespresso the cheapest the they also have more expensive one can go up to few thousands so it is kind of expensive you know for me to buy both Nespresso and, and those gusto capsule coffee machine uh, but luckily luckily I found that in Lazar there's actually a type of coffee machine that can do three tasks which they are compatible to not only Nespresso those gusto but also ground coffee powder and this is that coffee machine it is actually called high brew carina to espresso stations okay so i actually bought this from lazada for around 330 ringgit which is less than 100 usd that can do the job of three machine okay so next we're gonna move on to unboxing and after that, we're gonna try out some coffee. So this is the unboxing of High Brew Carina 2 Espresso Station. So this is basically a three-in-one capsule coffee machine. Okay, so basically it can support Nespresso capsule, Dos Gusto capsule, or even ground coffee powder. Okay, so basically High Brew is actually a brand, uh, is actually a US brand. 
uh, it's just that its production is actually in China. You can actually find this brand in Amazon, which is the something like Lazada back in US, and it's actually a quite high selling items. Okay, so let us look at a little bit of the spec list. Okay. So it actually has 19 bar of pressure of pump. Okay, so basically, in order for you to get a good coffee, you definitely need to have enough special, uh, enough pressure. So 19 bar is definitely good, and then it has 600 ml of water tank capacity. And the best thing is, it has optional adapter for different capsule, as you can see here. So this is the Nespresso uh, adapter. So this is for the coffee powder, and this is for those gusto. Okay, so and the power and voltage here yeah, can be used in Malaysia. Okay, so now let's check it out how, you, how it looks like. Okay, so we have the uh, manual instructions. Okay, so this is the coffee machine. You gotta be, be careful not to ruin it. Okay, so Okay, so this is basically they give us free capsule to try out, coffee capsule. Moment of truth. Then, what are these? This should be the capsule adapter. So, this one is actually made from. This one I believe is for those crystal because it's bigger. So basically it's a plastic uh, but it's it's not cheap plastic though, it's uh, actually BPA free plastic. So uh, it won't cause any like health concern. This is the uh, uh, this is the ground coffee ground coffee adapter. Okay, and we have one more. So let's let's peel off the protective layer. Okay. So this is the this is the water tank. And okay. So this is how it looks like. I will say it's again it's made from plastic but uh it actually doesn't look cheap. It actually looks pretty decent, you know. It looks like those uh Nescus, those Custo and Nespresso machine, but it's, it's not that premium. But bear in mind this costs only around 320 ringgit, which is less than 100 USD. So get what you pay for the price. So far so good. Okay, so it actually has a suction cup, you know, you know, for in order for you to fix the coffee machine position, so it's good. So this is the power button. You have the espresso size and this long lungo size. I believe it's lungo. That's how they call it. So I believe this is yeah. So this is the Nespresso adapter. Okay, so it's smaller. So this is the unboxing. So let's take this to the kitchen and let's brew some coffee. The coffee machine has been set up and we just gonna add some water into the water tank. And click on the power button to start it up. You can choose between espresso and lungo size. So for espresso, it will brew 50 milliliters of coffee, while for lungo, it will brew around 120 milliliters of coffee. Okay, so we will start with an espresso capsule, and we will put it in this adapter. So it's actually pretty easy. You just need to open it up. There's this slot here. You just need to 
put the capsule in here make sure it is fully inserted and close it up then open it up and insert it inside and secure the adapter and put in the coffee mark and I'll go for our Lango setting because I don't usually drink espresso okay while the coffee is brewing I found out that uh, this machine is actually pretty small and short so that's good and bad about it the good one is uh, it won't take up a lot of space well, the bad thing is a uh, normal coffee mug uh, is very hard to fit under this machine so you need a shorter coffee mug for this and here comes the coffee okay so far coffee looks very creamy okay so it's done now and there you go a nice cup of coffee you can add in milk after this so as you can see, the foam put off looks very nice. Okay, so now we move on to those gusto capsule. So for those gusto, I'm going to to brew the green tea latte. Okay, so but for those gusto machine, the water level is a little bit specific. As you can see from here, it's not like Nespresso. You can either go for espresso or lungo for those gusto the water level will be a little bit different so in this case you will need to eyeball the water level so actually you can manually stop the water level whenever you feel suit by just clicking on the button when it is going okay so i'm going to show you later so now let us start the machine so this is the milk capsule so, and this is the go those gusto adapter the milk capsule will need to fill until around half of the cup so I will go for the lungo selection and then I will try to stop it when it's around half cup Okay, almost there. We will stop here. Okay, so around half cup, and we change to we change to the green tea capsule. So okay, so again, you're gonna eyeball this one. So I'll stop it when it reach reach around here. Let's go. And we see the green tea is coming out. Okay, so we can stop it when it's around this level. And stop. And there you have it. Green tea latte. Foam looks very nice. Okay. After using this machine, the cleaning is also very easy. So you just need to take out the adapter. Just wash it and you just need to take a damp cloth and as you can see inside there is a blade now you need to be careful with it and just gently wipe, wipe it off so the maintenance of this machine is pretty easy in conclusion I definitely approve this for cheapo because this machine only costs 300 ringgit which is less than 100 USD dollar and it can actually do the job of three different coffee machines so how do you get this you can get this either through Lazada in Malaysia or if you are from US or your place has Amazon you can get it from Amazon and that's it for the video today I hope my video helps you in choosing the best type of coffee machine for you I'll see you in the next video